guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna have a look at the five easiest diamonds to get in the Hunter Call of the Wild right now, starting with the female Gemspock. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna count down from five all the way to the number one easiest diamond to get in the game right now. If you do enjoy this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button, click that notify bell to ensure that you never miss another video. Let's head right into it. So right now we are in the bottom left-hand corner of the map and this, if you can believe all these Gemspock here are in one drink zone. This is the best spot bar none on the entire map. It used to be just to the right on the cliff side here, but since the last update, they've actually moved the spot to the top of the lake. So when you are scouting out for a diamond female Gemsbok, you really need to pay attention to the trophy estimate. Now diamond for Gemsbok is 337.5 and level four female Gemsbok go diamond all the time. Not all the time, but a lot more often than males do. And that was a pretty nice one. I don't think it's a diamond, but it's a pretty decent one. So basically just look for the ones with the biggest horns and make sure that it is a potential diamond that 337 falls into that trophy range. And those are the ones you want to shoot first. And that, my friends, is the very best spot on the map to find Gemsbok. I mean, you'll find them a lot more places than that. So this was actually on stream not too long ago. I have shot a few female diamond Gemsbok on stream just in the last few weeks. They really are one of the very easiest diamonds to get in the game. Well, there she is. Look at the size of the horns on her. Go. She is beautiful. Diamond, she is a diamond. All right, well, that's pretty sweet. And funny enough, most of the diamond Gemsbok that I have been shooting have been from the same location on different servers, right from this spot right here. So definitely check this spot out. You might just find a nice big female diamond Gemsbok there. So our next easiest diamond in the countdown are all of the species of Ibex. I've put them all into this one category. So you're actually getting three additional animals. So we're gonna start with the Greedos. And again, you need to remember that they can go diamond and often do at level four. So you really have to pay attention to their trophy rating. So they go diamond at 100.1. So if the range, if 100.1 falls into their trophy range, that is a diamond potential Greedos. And those are the ones you wanna kill first. But this has been the best lake for Greedos on the entire map. So the next Ibex we're gonna look at are the Besiet Ibex, and this is the very best spot on the map for them. We are on top of Besiet Mountain, and this is an awesome spot for you to drop a tent because it is a bit of a pain in the neck to get up here. It does take some time, and you can just find so many of them from up here. You can also hunt them from the bottom, but this is the best spot on the map. And again, they do often go diamond at level four, so diamond trophy for Besiet is 191.6. So you're looking for a trophy range that the top number is above that. That 191.6 falls in that range somewhere. So level fours and level fives are what you're looking for. Just gonna take that guy down. You can use the 30 odd six, the seven mil, the M1. For all of these Ibex, awesome weapons to use. You get integrity with all of them. It would be a good idea to plop a tripod if you are gonna kill a bunch of them up here because you will destroy those zones pretty quickly. Now I just took this guy down. As an afterthought, we shot the four first, but that is a level three, not a monster. That guy is a silver. Gonna get my dog to track and we crashed, but that's okay. Here we are. So this is Besiet Mountain. This is an amazing, the very best spot for Besiet Ibex on the map. I would hit this spot on different multiplayers over and over again. And this lake here, also really good for Besiet. I have shot a couple different diamond Besiet from that lake as well. So both of those definitely check. Alrighty, moving on to Southeastern Spanish Ibex. So with the Southeastern Spanish Ibex, there are actually five different lakes where you can hunt them that are surrounding their mountain. But this lake is the very best, the very best I have actually shot I think every single diamond southeastern Spanish Ibex off of this one lake that I have ever shot. Shot, is that a word <laughs> that I have ever shot? And this, my friends, if you can believe this, I'm just here looking for Ibex to show you, and this is a guaranteed level four diamond. 
Their diamond trophy rating is 89.6 and the bottom estimate started at 90 and this one over here is a potential diamond. It was up to 95. I think they both are. <laughs> they both were. All right, well that first guy was not a diamond. 86.8, I think that said. But this guy should actually be a diamond. So that just shows you how easy these diamonds are. I literally came out here to show you some footage and I shot this today. That is pretty crazy. So that is where we found that diamond and that, my friends, is the very best southeastern Spanish Ibex lake that there is, but all five of these lakes, you will find them drinking around. All right, so the Ronda Ibex are our very last species of Ibex to look at today. And they have two main lakes that they like to drink around, but this is the very best one. This is the middle, the middle lake on the right-hand side. And you're gonna usually find two or three drink zones here for them. Now again, you are looking for level fours and level fives. You're looking for 107.9, that is diamond. So you're looking for a top trophy rating that goes above that, above 107.9. You know, level four diamonds are just as good as level five. As long as it is a diamond, doesn't matter to me what level the animal is, really doesn't. But we just took a couple down there. Normally I have a zone. That's just a three, didn't even make gold. But that was a pretty sweet shot. That was a double long heart from 304.25 meters. Yeah, normally I have a drink zone right above there, but I have a resting Iberian wolf zone right beside there. So you do need to be aware of that. So this lake above will also have Rhonda and sometimes this lake right here as well. All right, moving on to number three. The third easiest diamond in the game right now is the Cinnamon Teal. So you're gonna find these in Parquet Fernando. And as far as hotspots go, you're gonna find cinnamon teal on every piece of water on the entire map. And really all you have to do is visit every piece of water and make sure you spot every single duck. If you don't spot one, it's gonna be that level three. They are pretty common. Level twos can make diamond. They don't make it that often, but I have shot a level two diamond teal. Actually, the last piebald cinnamon teal that I shot was a level two and it turned out to be a diamond, which was pretty awesome. So when you are hunting for cinnamon teal, you'll want to use the 22 or any shotgun, but you do want to get good with the 22. So what I do is I mark, I mark that level three duck or whatever duck it is I am planning on shooting very precisely with a waypoint. And then I make sure that I am exactly either 100 or 150 meters back so that I have my zeroing set very precisely. These ducks are tiny and them being off by even 10 meters can mess up your shot. There we go, we got him. Your duck will immediately start floating to you so don't go anywhere once you've shot that duck it's gonna float to exactly where you shot it from. So that guy is a gold, 4.4, and 4.6 for cinnamon teal is your trophy for diamond. But basically every piece of water in Parquet Fernando will have ducks swimming most of the time. So moving on to number two, the second easiest diamond in the game right now are turkeys. <laughs> and again, unbelievable, but I decided to go filmed some turkeys for this video and the very first lake I go to. There is a level three turkey. Pretty much illustrates my point. These are not hard diamonds to get. Very, very common. I have just a pile of diamond turkeys in my lodge and my PC lodge I haven't even been using for very long and I think I have maybe eight diamond turkeys in there. So yeah, I shot that guy today. <laughs> but yeah, turkeys drink in Silver Ridge Peaks from 15 until 16 or 1630. So I just wanted to show you, there you go. There's today's date. <laughs> that just shows you how easy these guys are. So this is on a live stream from not very long ago. Turkey. Level three turkey, all right. <laughs> okay, let's shoot them. We have, we have a diamond turkey with the bow. So this guy gets to die right now. There we go. So that was on stream and actually the day before or a couple days before that I had shot a level three turkey with the bow and found another level three turkey at a different lake that had vanished. So they are just all over the place. There we go, 
Aren't they all? <laughs> ah, we'll taxi that guy. So that's where I found that diamond turkey, but you can check most of the lakes in Silver Ridge Peaks for turkeys when they drink. And we're on to number one, the easiest diamond to get in the game right now are mountain lions. Uh, <laughs> Guess what I just found? Nine legendary. <laughs> nice. <What a> <laughs> I love this awesome. lake. So this is actually last Friday on stream. We did a mountain lion competition and this is the very first cat that I found. That's why I'm laughing so hard. Pretty crazy. <laughs> he dead. It's a diamond. <laughs> Oh it's a diamond. <laughs> Sweet. And that that's is it. We're going to Medved. <laughs> that's it. We're going to Medved. All right. Competition's over, guys. It's a small diamond. It's a yeah, I'm laughing so hard because I'm literally five minutes into the competition and I have shot my first diamond mountain lion. So that pretty much illustrates that they are really not that hard to find. And if you can believe it, this is later on in the same stream, I have found another level. <laughs> <laughs> we got them. Yeah, they are very, very common. And it was also another diamond. Like, I'm in disbelief. Now, mountain lions can only be a diamond when they are level 9, just so you guys know. And their trophy is 39.0. If you'd like to check out all the hot spots for mountain lions, definitely check my where and when to find each species in Silver Ridge Peaks. And I will leave the link below the video. Okay, so we're very quickly gonna have a quick peek in my lodge just to show you how many diamonds of each of these species that I have right now. These are the mountain lions. I have quite a few and this account, this is my PC account. This is not the account that I've been playing on for years. I actually have a bunch more in my Xbox lodge, but here are a couple of diamond female Gemsbok. They are very beautiful. And I do have another one in a different lodge. So look at all the turkeys. They are very, very common. Not that hard to find. So definitely these are the species you wanna look for when you are looking for your first diamond. And I even found a diamond gray mountain lion, which is a pretty sweet find. And this is my every diamond with the bow lodge. So we did get a diamond gemsbok and a diamond turkey and a diamond mountain lion with the bow, which was pretty awesome. I have not been doing any hunting very much at all in Parquet, so I don't have a lot of cinnamon teals, but I have just a pile on Xbox. But that's gonna wrap it up for this one, guys. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to join us for more, that would be amazing. All you have to do is hit that subscribe button and we will see you guys in the next one. If you'd like to learn more amazing hotspots, make sure to click on this where and when video. Take care.